everyone. So today's workout is going to focus strictly on our core muscles. So I'm going to get on the ground and we're going to get started. So we're going to lie down on our backs. Okay, so you want your feet not too far out in front, not too close, but right in the middle. And our first core exercise is going to be the sit up. So we're going to start lying flat down on our back with our knees up, feet planted on the ground. And we're going to slide our hands all the way up, activating that core to help sit you up. And slide back down, nice and controlled, keeping that core nice and tight. Again, we're going to slide our hands on the floor all the way up. And come back down, keeping that core nice and engaged, nice and controlled. We're going to come slide our hands up and back down. Three more. Slide your hands all the way up and slide them all the way back down, nice and controlled, engaging that core. Two more. Slide all the way up. Come back down, nice and controlled. Last one. All the way up, slide those hands on the ground, and nice and controlled all the way back down. All right, so our next core exercise we're going to work on are toe touches. So again, lying flat down on the ground, and then you're gonna bring both legs up together. They could be completely together, they could be spread apart slightly. They do not have to be, uh, they do not have to be all the way straight. Go into your comfort. If you feel a nice stretch, you just don't wanna feel any pain. So we're gonna start in this position. Our hands are gonna come up and we're gonna bring our upper body up and try and reach our fingers to our toes. So I'm gonna show you like that and back down, up. Back down, up, and back down. So we're gonna try that five more times. So we're gonna reach up to our toes, back down, reach up to our toes, back down, good, three more. Reach up to those toes, back down, reach up to those toes, one more. Reach as far as you can and back down. All right. Next one I'm gonna show, it's called a side to side sweep. So we're gonna start in the same position with our feet planted flat on the ground, our back on the ground. We're gonna bring our upper body up slightly off the ground. And we're gonna bring our left hand and slide it on the floor to try and reach our left heel. And we're gonna come back to the center, staying up, keeping your upper body up so we're keeping that core nice and engaged. We're gonna slide our right hand and try and reach our right heel and come back to the center. Slide your left hand and try and get your fingers to your left heel and back to the center and slide your right hand, try and reach your right fingers to your right heel and back to the center. Okay, we're gonna try five of those. In three, two, one, up. Slide to the left, try and touch your heel, back to the center. Slide your right hand to your right heel, back to the center. Left hand to our right, left heel, back to the center. Right hand to your right heel, back to the center. Left hand to your left heel, back to the center. And right hand to your right heel, back to the center. Keeping that core nice and engaged the whole time. So our last exercise I'm gonna show you guys for core is going to be the Russian twist. So if you're just starting off with this exercise, you wanna have your feet planted on the ground, just as I am. If you want, you could have something in front of you to hold your feet from moving, okay? And then you want to lean back slightly so you have your core activated. And we're going to bring both of our hands over, twist to the left side, and back to the center. Twist to the right side, back to the center. Twist to the left side, back to the center. Twist to the right side, 
back to the center. I will turn and show you guys from the front. Okay, so feet planted on the ground, leaning back slightly. We're gonna twist to our left side, back to the center, twist to the right side, back to the center. Now, if you're feeling like you want a little more of a challenge, you're gonna bring your feet up in the air. So you're gonna bring your feet up, okay, keeping that core nice and engaged. And same thing with your upper body, twist to the left side, up to the center, twist to the right side, up to the center. Okay, so we're gonna try 10 of those. So I'm gonna do five with my feet planted on the ground and five with my feet elevated. So twist to the left, center, twist to the right, center, left, center, right, center, left, center, twist to the right, back to the center, left, center, right, center, one more each side, left, center, to the right, center. Now I'm gonna do five with my feet elevated off the ground. So twist to the left, center, right, center, left, center, right, center, that's two, left, center, right, center, that's three, left, center, right, center, four, one last one each side, right, center. All right, so we worked out our core muscles, so we're gonna wanna stretch those now. So we're gonna go ahead and get onto our stomachs, and we're gonna have our hands right in line with your chest, keeping your lower half on the floor. You're gonna straighten those arms up so you get a nice stretch in your stomach. Okay, stretch out all those muscles that we just used. Only go up as far as you feel a stretch. If you feel a stretch here, that's great, and you can hold that. If you want more of a stretch, come up a little bit further as far as you could go without any pain. You'll hold that. Today's code word is core. C-O-R-E, core. Don't forget to log today's code word. All right. Now we're going to come back up. And we're gonna stretch our sides now. So feet out shoulder width apart a little bit further. Take our right arm, reach all the way to the left side and hold for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. We're gonna do the other side, left arm, all the way over to the right side and hold for one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, awesome job, everyone.